Lastly, I want to play this clip from the um, uh, that's coming out of uh, Alabama. This is um, this is uh, uh, pretty sad, and um, it's a guy who is uh, apparently was out in front of um, a Roy Moore rally in Midland. This is on uh, this is last night, I guess, and uh, he's a peanut farmer. His name is Nathan Mathis. And he's holding a picture of his daughter, Patty Sue Mathis. Um, and he's got a sign there. Um, here, well, he, he'll, he's, he, it, it's heartbreaking. My name is Nathan Mathis. My daughter was Patty Sue Mathis. That's her right there. Judge Roy Moore called her a pervert on one reason, because she was gay. If he called her a prevert, he called your child a prevert if she was gay or your son was gay. This is something people need to stop and think about. You're supposed to uphold the Constitution. The Constitution said all men are created equal. Well, how is my daughter a prevert just because she was gay? Does it mean she was born gay? I don't know the answer to that. But she was gay. There she is. Are you a man of faith? Am I a man of faith? Yes, I am. Being out here tonight, what do you hope to accomplish? I don't know what I'll accomplish. I really don't. I had mixed emotions about coming, but somebody needs to speak up. And if it's all to no avail, so be it. It won't be the first time I've done something to no avail, okay? How far have you But my is it? sign there speaks for itself. And my sign is true. Sir? How far of a drive was this for you? It's, I'm only about 15 to 20 miles away. I was born here in Midland City. Sir, are you suggesting that the suicide of your daughter was because of... No, I'm not, like suggest that? I'm not suggesting that. I was anti-gay myself. I said bad things to my daughter myself, which I regret. But I can't take back what happened to my daughter. But stuff like saying my daughter's a prevert, sure, I'm sure that bothered her. Now, you know, Judge Moore not just said my daughter, he didn't call my daughter by name. He said all gay people are preverts, abominations. That's not true. We don't need a person like that representing us in Washington. So, um, if you, if, you, if you did not catch that for uh, some reason, a reporter had uh, basically said, do you think that's why she committed suicide? Uh, so here's a guy who's obviously um, filled with uh, un, unimaginable regret for um, contributing to in, uh, a feeling that may ultimately have led to his daughter's suicide. I mean, we don't, obviously don't know the details, but... Um, I think that comes across. Stuff like that has immense power, I would imagine, uh, for people in Alabama, I would hope. Hi, folks. Sam Cedar here. We still need your help on our Patreon page. YouTube ads have come back, but not nearly as much as we had before. So if you can help us out, any little bit helps. Head over to our Patreon page right at this URL and you'll help us keep helping you by making videos.